Thomas Alive Today presents Orchard Supply Hardware Orchard Supply Hardware was formed in 1931 as the Orchard Supply Farmers Co-op by 30 farmers consisting mostly of orchardists and fruit tree ranchers who banded together to form a cooperative to buy essential farm supplies. Each farmer put up $30 and in the midst of the Great Depression a new company was formed. Stanley B. Smith served as the company's first general manager and president. Operations started in a rented warehouse at 230 Bassett Street in San Jose, California. In spite of the Great Depression, the cooperative was successful. In 1933, the co-op moved to a larger location at 44 Vine Street in San Jose. The new location featured a large retail display area, off-street parking, and an adjoining warehouse. In 1946, the company moved to a site at 720 West San Carlos Street in San Jose. By then, there were almost 2,000 members. In 1962, Albert B. Smith became president, expanding the business into a chain of stores which had 25,000 square feet each were considered large at the time. By 1950, the electronics industry began booming in the Santa Clara Valley and with it came an abundance of new homeowners in the San Francisco Bay Area. The orchards gradually became residential neighborhoods and the Orchard Supply Farmers Co-op became a for-profit corporation Orchard Supply Hardware Retail Stores. In the early 1960s, the city of San Jose denied Al Smith permission to install a sign along Osiris Street to promote his Orchard Supply Hardware Store because a sign for the store already existed facing San Carlos Street. Undeterred, Smith bought a railroad boxcar from Southern Pacific, painted the car with the OSH logo and placed it at the end of the spur track behind his store and alongside Osiris Street. It remained in that spot for nearly 50 years and was occasionally featured in OSH's promotional material. Recognizing its historic relationship to the San Jose community, OSH donated the boxcar to the California Trolley and Railroad Corporation in 2013 for display in History Park at Kelly Park. In 1977, the company purchased a 19-acre warehouse and office complex from SunSweet Growers to serve as a distribution center. In the 1980s, Lauren S. Smith became president and continued the expansion. In 1992, the distribution center was moved to Tracy, California. Orchard Supply Hardware ceased to be a privately owned company when it and its seven stores were acquired by W.R. Grace and Company in 1979. W.R. Grace operated the company seven years before it sold the company along with another hardware chain to the Wix companies in 1986. Wix operated the company for three years before selling the company to its managers in 1989. OSH was purchased by Sears in 1996 after seven years of independence. In 2005 Sears sold a 19.9% interest in the company to Aries Management of Los Angeles for 58.7 million US dollars announcing expansion plans at the time. Aries had the option to later purchase another 30.2% stake in the company for 126.8 million US dollars but did not exercise this right. OSH had 84 stores at the time. At roughly the same time Sears Holdings announced that its Sears Roebuck and Company subsidiary expected to receive a dividend from OSH of about 450 million US dollars. In connection with the initial investment OSH was expected to issue 405 million US dollar in debt. This debt was later cited as one of the primary reasons for its 2013 Chapter 11 filing. Later several of the Southern California locations of the bankrupt builders Emporium chain of hardware stores were purchased in preparation of expansion into that region. OSH was spun out of Sears Holdings in 2012 and became a public company. In January 2012 shares began trading on the Nasdaq stock market. In April 2013 OSH expanded beyond California opening stores in the suburban Portland metropolitan area of Oregon. In November 2014 the company opened its first location in the city of San Francisco. 
The North Beach store located at 2598 Taylor Street is a former Petco and has a planned June 2015 opening. The store represents a new strategy for Lowe's to enter urban regions and markets using the OSH brand. This was following the opening of a store in the population-dense Mid Wilshire district of Los Angeles. On June 17, 2013 Orchard Supply Hardware announced it filed for Chapter 11 under the U.S. Bankruptcy Code and that most of its assets would be sold to the Lowe's home improvement chain for $205 million in cash. Lowe's agreed to acquire no fewer than 60 of the 91 Orchard Supply stores operating them separately from Lowe's. At the close of the process Orchard Supply remained a separate brand and operating entity from the Lowe's chain. In August 2013 preparations were made to close 17 of the 99 stores. Two of the stores were closed in June as a part of normal operations. This left 70 of the pre-Chapter 11 announcement stores still in operation. According to a company spokesperson workers at the stores that closed were not eligible for severance pay due to the bankruptcy proceeding but Orchard Supply is providing incentive bonuses to key employees. Lowe's also committed to investing 200 million US dollar in OSH over the next five years. Via the technology program launched initially by Lowe's in 2014, OSH announced a pilot program using robot employees at their San Jose store at 377 Royal Avenue. The devices called OSH bots were supplied by a Mountain View company called Fellow Robots. The OS bots resembled white columns with two large LCD screens and were equipped with 3D cameras so they could identify items brought in by customers and had wheels on either side that helped them move. Customers could research items on the screens and then the robot could lead them to the aisle where an item was located. The robots spoke English and Spanish and were connected to an inventory database so they could inform customers if an item was out of stock. The robots were the result of a process that Lowe's uses for new developments. According to Lowe's Innovation Labs director Kyle Nell, what we actually do is use the process called science fiction prototyping where we give all our marketing research and trend data to professional published science fiction writers. The OS bots were not meant to replace humans but Nell also stated we have amazing store associates but they probably don't know the real-time location of every single object in the store. In 2016 Lowe's announced the expansion of the Orchard brand to South Florida. On August 22, 2018 Lowe's publicly announced that Orchard Supply Hardware would be closed down nationwide and would begin liquidation. It said stores would be closed by the following February and all had been closed by November. In 2019 Central Network Retail Group purchased leases to seven former OSH locations in the San Francisco Bay Area. These new stores were to be called Outdoor Supply Hardware and kept a similar appearance and experience as the old OSH stores. By 2020 the chain expanded to 11 locations. Hello. Do you have a set of metric wrenches? Uh, yeah. And one of those... Angly paintbrushes? Yes. Can you fix my screen door? Of course. Do you have a birdhouse that's like a cute little lake cottage with a decorative field stone fireplace? Like this? Yeah. <laughs> I'll be right over. Come meet your new neighbors at Orchard. Home, hardware, and happiness. If you have any fond memories, please indicate it at the comments below. Thanks for watching, subscribe and like.